so welcome back again to my channel um, today I'll gonna show you how to uh, modify the ball body plate for 4L60 automatic transmission so this is one the one here so this is the ball body we already clean and uh, free up all the bulbs so this is the new ball body plate that we are going to drill on um, so this one here we're gonna drill the the orifice for the one to up shape orifice and the three fourth uh check bull or a face and this one here is for the three to solenoid uh supply fluid supply pressure so we're going to drill this one around uh 15 this is the this is the uh, diameter of the drill bit that we are going to use it's 1364 so this one here and this one here is 1364 and the rest is uh, 3, 332 so 332 equivalent of 2.4 millimeter So let's start drilling on it. This one this uh, hole here is for three to solenoid uh, fluid supply and the other one here which is the bigger just just two holes are bigger than the other so so this one is for the second uh, two third shuttle valve we're gonna drill this one of uh, 1364 or 5.5.2 uh, millimeter. this one here because there is some uh, uh, metal that dropped in here and that's too sharp we need to drill a bit bigger just on this the upper portion of the hole so that it will uh,
smaller hole. So yeah, the purpose of drilling a hole on the valve body plate is to strengthen the life of the uh, friction plate or the clutch pack uh, because the common for this previous model without the modification it, the valve body plate is always burned the third and fourth clutch always burn same as this I'll show you the old one so the old one was the chick ball was stuck there see this was stuck on the on the ball body plate well once this one stuck the third and fourth definitely will gonna be burned so and you don't have any third uh, and it will shift to direct to the fourth and um, we're gonna replace this three to uh, yeah. valve spring and yeah the three, the three to solenoid uh, o-ring this one so this is the old one and this is the new one including the balbari kit so the difference is huge for this one so the the new one is improvised modified into more more strength on it yeah so we're gonna uh, replace this one and put back the solenoid so that's all for now guys uh, hope you learned this video if you like just give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe my channel thanks very much for watching see you next time